dreams of explorers, historians, and archaeologists for centuries. A tomb sealed for thousands of years enshrouds the secrets of a dynasty that shaped an empire. This tomb holds the legacy of an emperor whose name still resonates through the annals of history. As the world holds its collective breath, scientists from across the globe have embarked on a quest to unlock the mysterious secrets of this subterranean wonder. But what lies within the tomb of China's first emperor? Why has it remained hidden from the world for so long? Join us as we unravel how scientists finally opened the tomb of China's first emperor, which was sealed for thousands of years. The reign of Qin Shi Huang and his legacy is a tale of power, ambition, and conquest. Qin Shi Huang, a prominent figure in Chinese history, wielded immense power during his reign. Born approximately in 259 BCE in the state of Qin, where his father was once held captive, Qin Shi Huang ascended to the throne at the tender age of 13. Early on, he exhibited an extraordinary determination and a knack for conquest. This young emperor-to-be was not alone in his quest for dominance. He had a brilliant advisor named Li Si, who played a pivotal role in helping him solidify his authority and expand his realm. Additionally, his trusted general, Wang Jian, skillfully led his forces to triumph over adversaries. Employing a combination of diplomacy, deception, and sheer military might, Qin Shi Huang systematically subdued the other six warring states, commencing with Han in 230 BCE and concluding with Qi by 221 BCE. This marked the unification of China under his rule, and he proclaimed himself its first emperor. However, Qin Shi Huang's aspirations transcended mere rulership. He aimed to bolster and enhance the grandeur of his empire. To this end, he initiated a plethora of reforms and projects. He standardized the writing system, currency, weights, measures, and laws, fostering administrative efficiency. A vast network of roads and canals was built to interconnect diverse regions, fostering trade and communication. Notably, he commissioned the construction of the Great Wall, a formidable barrier stretching thousands of kilometers along the northern frontier to safeguard against nomadic invaders. Yet Qin Shi Huang was not solely driven by the desire for territorial power. He harbored a fascination for the unknown and the enigmatic, launching daring expeditions to explore and chart uncharted lands beyond his borders. His quest for immortality became an enduring obsession. One of the most remarkable achievements attributed to Qin Shi Huang is the creation of the Terracotta Army. Qin Shi Huang, a forward-thinking and visionary leader, left an indelible mark on ancient China. Under his rule, the once fragmented Qin state transformed into a mighty and prosperous empire. His reign, spanning from 220 to 210 BCE, witnessed an array of remarkable achievements and innovations. However, it is essential to acknowledge that alongside these feats, there were instances of destruction and oppression. Qin Shi Huang's infamous actions, like the burning of books and the burial of scholars, sparked fear and resentment among the populace. This harsh rule led to uprisings and rebellions against his authority. Ultimately, his life came to an end during a routine tour of inspection in 210 BCE. One of the most intriguing and enigmatic legacies he left behind was his mausoleum, known as the Mausoleum of the First Qin Emperor. This remarkable structure remained concealed for thousands of years, its secrets locked away until the 20th century. The story of its discovery began humbly when local farmers sought to excavate a water well in 1974. Little did they know that their ordinary endeavor would soon evolve into a global sensation and a site of paramount archaeological significance. Yang, a resident of Yang Village, became the unwitting pioneer when he and his fellow workers delved deeper into the earth's depths. Their shovels and picks unearthed several terracotta fragments. The true significance of their find was initially shrouded in mystery. Without realizing the value of their discovery, the farmers dutifully reported it to local authorities. News of this remarkable find swiftly spread, capturing the attention of Chinese archaeologists. Preliminary expeditions were dispatched to investigate the site, gradually unraveling the initial scale and potential importance of the discovery. It was not long before systematic excavations, conducted under the guidance of the Archaeological Institute of Shangxi, began in earnest. What the experts found left them astounded. 
a vast subterranean complex housing an entire army of life-size terracotta soldiers, horses, and chariots meticulously arranged as if poised for an eternal battle. This awe-inspiring find would go on to be known as the Terracotta Army, an archaeological treasure that not only showcased Qin Shi Huang's ambition but also shed light on a fascinating chapter in ancient Chinese history. The unearthing of the ancient mausoleum, along with its intriguing contents, triggered a profound surge of interest in China's rich history and the captivating realm of archaeology. Scholars and enthusiasts from all corners of the globe eagerly made their way to the city of Xi'an, driven by an insatiable desire to delve into the secrets concealed beneath the Earth's surface. This worldwide fascination, in turn, breathed new life into the local economy. Tourism flourished as visitors flocked to this historic site, transforming the region into a hub of cultural exploration. Recognizing the monumental cultural and historical significance of the mausoleum, the Chinese government swiftly invested in its preservation, presenting it as a testament to the grandeur of China's ancient legacy. In 1987, this extraordinary complex, comprising the mausoleum and the renowned Terracotta Army, earned the prestigious designation of a UNESCO World Heritage Site. This accolade firmly established its status as one of the most astounding archaeological wonders the world has ever witnessed. But what about the mysterious theory that haunts the history of the mausoleum's construction? It suggests a chilling narrative. Over 700,000 individuals were conscripted into service and subsequently met their untimely demise to safeguard the enigmatic secrets enshrouding the mausoleum. Before we delve into the intricacies of this unsettling theory, it is crucial to grasp the sheer scale and audacious ambition that underpinned the mausoleum project. Encompassing a colossal expanse of more than 56 square kilometers, the mausoleum represented a monumental endeavor, one that is believed to have spanned several decades in its completion. The sheer magnitude of such an undertaking necessitated the construction.